Jared, they um, they were 12 of 16 on layups and dunks and 15 of 23 on threes. What were they doing so well offensively and maybe what wasn't working for you guys defensively? Um, we knew coming into the game that Notre Dame was a good offensive team. And, uh, you know, they move the ball well. They play um, – pretty methodical as far as how they want to go about things. Um, but in my opinion, they were just entirely too comfortable. You know, you see a couple go in, you catch the ball right in the three-point line, you knock a couple down early. <clears throat> I feel like, I mean, I'm looking at the box where the entire team was too comfortable. I mean, pretty much all of them way above 50%. And I mean, we just, we weren't up to the challenge, you know, and like we did a pretty solid job in the first half you know we did better second half we didn't make the plays that we needed to make and I mean it's it's that simple we didn't make the necessary defensive plays that we we needed to make and I, I take credit for that as well I, I off the top of my head two mistakes late that were my responsibility it's not good enough against a good offensive team like that obviously they had it going already but that's no excuse for being able to uh, you know handle the assignment, that's your, that's your responsibility. And uh, we didn't do a good job of that across the board. What makes them so difficult offensively? Um, they're a high IQ team. They got a good feel for the game. They know how to play with each other. They've got six or seven guys who can really shoot the ball at a high level. Um, you know, they, they, Coach Bray, obviously, he's a good coach. You know, I mean, they, they got a lot of things going for them, really. They're just they, they know how to play with each other. You know, they got an experienced team that, that plays with each other. They got high IQ guys. Their bigs know what they're doing in the offense. They move the ball quick. Um, and they can shoot the ball at a high level, which puts a lot of pressure on you defensively. And uh, that's what they did today. They made a lot of shots. This was the biggest crowd of the year. And, and as you guys are coming off the floor, your their boos pretty loud. How do you react to that? And what do, you, what do you say to the fans? I understand the frustration. Um, you know, there's a standard here, and uh, we're not living up to that right now. Obviously, it's hard. You know, you never want to walk off the off the floor, and your home fans are booing you. Um, I don't know if I've ever been booed, really. So, I know it's hard for me, but. Uh, Again, you know, there's an expectation here. And right now, we're not really in a position to <clears throat> say that we've met that expectation. Um, you know, it's, it's tough. It's obviously frustrating. You know, we're frustrated as well. And, uh, you know, we can't really think too much into that because, you know, I mean, that, that's outside our locker room. But at the end of the day, I mean, we got to – be better. Jerry, did they guard you any differently in the first half, go under a little less maybe after the way you shot the ball that first half? I don't I don't think so. Personally, I mean maybe I don't I don't think they made that much different adjustments. Are you talking about me specifically? Yeah. Yeah, I don't I, I don't think so. Um maybe if I watch the tape and see, but I mean, I just think they're playing, you know, regular defense. Sometimes it's just the flow of the game, you know, how it goes. So, uh, yeah. So, I got it. What, what was going on with the offense um, down the stretch? You stayed with them for eight minutes or so, and then the last eight minutes was a disaster offensively. Yeah. Uh, I know we missed some shots. Uh, we, let me see. Um, we, we missed some shots, and, you know, we weren't able to get on the offensive glass that much. I know we missed a couple, uh, you know, bunnies that I feel like a couple guys would like to get back, myself included. Um, you know, I feel like we tried to play the right way. We tried to do the right things. It's, uh, it's hard sometimes when you don't always get the reward you want. And, uh, you know, we just – we weren't able to make – Again, kind of goes back to the defense side. We weren't able to make the plays necessary on offense to to kind of keep the game close and where we need where we wanted it to be. So, anything else for Jerry? Thank you. Yeah.
Thanks, guys. Yep.